I have posted a video before regarding how to record a song cover using an iPhone connected to the V8 sound card and I received quite a few questions, queries, why is it not working for them? Why is it only vocals is recorded, not to the minus one? For some, not even the sound effects coming from the V8 sound card, it's not recording, so only the vocals. For some, nothing at all. So I'm hoping this video will answer that questions, why it is not working. Without further ado, let's get started. If you haven't watched yet the video I posted before on how to record a song cover using your iPhone or iOS device to connect from the V8 sound card, you don't need to worry. I'll go over that again on how to connect all these uh, wires. The only difference this time is I am going to use a laptop uh, to get my source uh, for my karaoke song or let's say background music or instrument or uh, minus one. So I'll be getting that from the laptop uh, using YouTube. Let me first show you the uh, connections of all these wires. Normally, this three cords here comes when you purchase a, a sound card. So this two here, the red ones, so one you can use for the backing track or or minus one. The other one uh, you can use for doing a live streaming. Let's say, for example, uh, live streaming or on on Facebook, and the other one for YouTube. Uh, and the the black wire here is for charging. So pretty much you just. Uh, connect one end to here and the other end it's up to you if you connect it to the uh, laptop or you can also connect it if you have something like this you can connect this as your wall charger so it's uh, it's up to you and uh, as long as uh, the sound card is not low battery you don't really need to connect this one uh, let's say you are going to be live for a few hours and i suggest connect this one but if not uh, that you can you can actually disconnect this one so something like that so less uh, wire so let's say for example we're not going to connect that because it's too much wires going on okay now let me show you the other one so the red one here okay so this uh, the one that says live one this is the one we are going to connect to uh, this phone here the iphone for recording or doing a live streaming now for the backing track this is connected so the one that says backing track right there this is connected to this laptop as uh, because this is the one i'll be using uh, uh, as my source for karaoke or minus one again backing track and uh, to the laptop where the wherever it says phones so that's where you connect the other end so that whatever audio that comes from the laptop will uh, go into this uh, sound card and now the earphone you can just you can select earphone or headphone i will be using uh, an a headset so it's right there so this is the one and it's right there the other end uh, so i can hear whatever is uh, uh, like the vocals as well as the minus one and of course this one is the microphone condenser microphone the one that says condenser microphone so okay let's uh, let's start as you can see on here i do have two lightning audio adapter one is longer one is shorter so the shorter one is the original lightning audio adapter when i purchased this iphone 8 plus and the longer one is the one i purchased from amazon so this is actually what i found out that if i'm going to use the the long one the not original so the one from amazon for doing a recording it did not work it only recorded the vocals but not to the sound effects from the sound card as well as no minus one is just your vocals but if i use the original uh, lightning audio adapter it does pick up everything like the the condensed the microphone and the minus one and even the sound effects if you would like to put uh, add sound effects from the v8 sound card first let me show you to record a song using the original lightning audio adapter so let's connect this one here and by the way this one is connected to this v8 sound card under live one 
So let's connect this over here. And by the way, you can always control the volume of the minus one from the gadget you are using or wherever the source uh, uh, from the minus one or karaoke is coming from. For example, since I am using the laptop, you can control the volume from here. So if we want it more louder or lower. And also you can control the minus one, the volume for the minus one from your uh, a v8 sound card so it's it's over here the one that says backing track and uh, i am going to be using a portable speaker later after we're recorded so we can hear uh, whatever is the result if it did record or no and uh, just additional information i will be using uh, this audio splitter also so it looks like that so it's like a y this is 3.5 mm and the other one i believe this is 3.5 mm uh, female adapter so it looks like that uh, so that i will only uh, plug it into one of these but you can for sure use also you can connect your your portable speaker directly so it's uh, the other end is this one so something like that so same ends i'll show you so they're both uh, like that one end you connect it to your uh a portable speaker and one end you can connect directly to the other one the one that says headphone or since i'm going to be using this uh, audio splitter i will connect it to one of the end and then the other end i will connect my headset or headphone so it's uh, it's up to you whatever is your uh, preference okay and uh, now we can start recording so for this one before i start recording i make sure this one is turned off because if this is on uh, while I am recording, this one will pick up also the audio from here. So if you're recording, it, it's best to just use the uh, headphone or headset. Okay, I'm just going to put in my headphone now and uh, I am now going to play on here and uh, start recording. <laughs> Okay, so let's uh, stop the recording. Let's stop this uh, minus one. And uh, now let's just turn on this uh, portable speaker. Okay, there it is. And let's now play if it did record. Okay, so the minus one is there for sure. And the vocals. There it is. So as you can see, it did work using this original uh, lightning audio adapter. And now I'm going to show you to record a song using this other lightning uh, audio adapter I bought from Amazon. So let's uh, do that and let's connect this one over here. Let's just uh, prepare our karaoke song. Let's just move it over there. Okay, and uh, I'll make sure this one, uh, the portable speaker is turned off because if it's on, if there is a voice coming out from here, uh, while we're recording, this one will pick up that audio as well. So I will be using a headset for recording. Okay, so I'm just going to play, I'm just going to hit record over there and play the uh, minus one. Okay, so let's stop this recording and let's stop that minus one and uh, let's now listen if it did record. So let's again turn this back on and let's now play the song if it did work. And then forward it some more. Okay, so there it is. As you can see, it did only record the vocal, but not the minus one. So uh, it is confirmed that uh, 
using this uh, audio lighting audio adapter from Amazon does not work. So for now, I don't know yet which other brand aside from the original lightning cable works in doing a recording or live streaming. But if I find out, find out something later, I'll, uh, I'm hoping to let you know if uh, there are specific other brands that works aside from the original lightning uh, cord comes when you purchase this uh, iPhone. And that's it for today. If you're new to this channel and if you like this video, please hit the like button and if you want to subscribe and also if you want to see more of this video, please uh, click the notification bell so you are updated to the latest videos I will be posting. Thanks again guys for watching. Until next time.